Feline viral rhinotracheitis. Feline viral rhinotracheitis FVR, is an upper respiratory or pulmonary infection of cats caused by Felid alpha herpes virus 1, FHV1, of the family Herpes viridae. It is also commonly referred to as feline influenza, feline coryza, and feline pneumonia but, as these terms describe other very distinct collections of respiratory symptoms, they are misnomers for the condition. Viral respiratory diseases in cats can be serious, especially in catteries and kennels. Causing one half of the respiratory diseases in cats, FVR is the most important of these diseases and is found worldwide. The other important cause of feline respiratory disease is feline calice virus. FVR is very contagious and can cause severe disease, including death from pneumonia in young kittens. It can cause flat-chested kitten syndrome, but most evidence for this is anecdotal. All members of the Felidae family are susceptible to FVR, in fact, FHV1 has caused a fatal encephalitis in lions in Germany. History FHV1 was first isolated from cats in 1958 in the United States. Transmission FVR is transmitted through direct contact only. It replicates in the nasal and nasopharyngeal tissues in the tonsils. Viremia, the presence of the virus in the blood, is rare. The virus is shed in saliva and eye and nasal secretions, and can also be spread by fomites. FVR has a 2 to 5 day incubation period. The virus is shed for 1 to 3 weeks post infection. Latently infected cats, carriers, will shed FHV1 intermittently for life, with the virus persisting within the trigeminal ganglion. Stress and use of corticosteroids precipitate shedding. Most disinfectants, antiseptics and detergents are effective against the virus. Clinical signs. Initial signs of FVR include coughing, sneezing, nasal discharge, conjunctivitis, and sometimes fever, up to 106, and loss of appetite. These usually resolve within 4 to 7 days, but secondary bacterial infections can cause the persistence of clinical signs for weeks. Frontal sinusitis and empyema can also result. FHV1 also has a predilection for corneal epithelium, resulting in corneal ulcers, often pinpoint or dendritic in shape. Other ocular signs of FHV1 infection include conjunctivitis, keratitis, keratoconjunctivitis sicca, decreased tear production, and corneal sequestra. Infection of the nasolacrimal duct can result in chronic epiphora, excess tearing. Ulcerative skin disease can also result from FHV1 infection. FHV1 can also cause abortion in pregnant queens, usually at the sixth week of gestation although this may be due to systemic effects of the infection rather than the virus directly. In chronic nasal and sinus disease of cats, FHV1 may play more of an initiating role than an ongoing cause. Infection at an early age may permanently damage nasal and sinus tissue, causing a disruption of ciliary clearance of mucus and bacteria, and predispose these cats to chronic bacterial infections. Diagnosis Diagnosis of FVR is usually by clinical signs, especially corneal ulceration. Dot definitive diagnosis can be done by direct immunofluorescence or virus isolation. However, many healthy cats are subclinical carriers of feline herpes virus, so a positive test for FHV1 does not necessarily indicate that signs of an upper respiratory tract infection are due to FVR. Early in the course of the disease, histological analysis of cells from the tonsils, nasal tissue, or nictitating membrane, third eyelid, may show inclusion bodies, a collection of viral particles, within the nucleus of infected cells. Treatment and Prevention Antibiotics are commonly used to prevent secondary bacterial infection. There are no specific antiviral drugs in common use at this time for FVR, although one study has shown that gancyclovir, Medap, and Sadafa hold promise for treatment. More recent research has indicated that systemic famcyclovir is effective at treating this infection in cats without the side effects reported with other antiviral agents. More severe cases may require supportive care such as intravenous fluid therapy, oxygen therapy, or even a feeding tube. Conjunctivitis and corneal ulcers are treated with topical antibiotics for secondary bacterial infection. Lysine is commonly used as a treatment. However in a 2015 systematic review, where the authors investigated all clinical trials with cats as well as in vitro studies, concluded that lysine supplementation is likely not effective for the treatment or prevention of feline herpes virus 1 infection. Vaccine 
There is a vaccine for FHV1 available, AT's vet code, QIO6008, WHO, plus various combination vaccines, but although it limits or weakens the severity of the disease and may reduce viral shedding, it does not prevent infection with FVR. Studies have shown a duration of immunity of this vaccine to be at least three years. The use of serology to demonstrate circulating antibodies to FHV1 has been shown to have a positive predictive value for indicating protection from this disease. Preventing spread of virus. Most household disinfectants will inactivate FHV1. The virus can survive up to 18 hours in a damp environment, but less in a dry environment and only shortly as an aerosol. Dot.